Oh, what have I done for volume? Where's your I'm not putting the bow on. Oh, put the bow on. It was cute. Right, fine. I'll go get the bow on. Nah, I... Nikki, I can't wear. Can't wear this. See, I can't see. <laughs> <laughs> I look like a cat or something. Next up on Coag on the couch is our head of development, Nikki for a sight. All right, you ready? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Louis. Hi, Nikki, how are you today? I'm good, thank you. Good, good. Oh, how are you coping? I'll have to sit back so you can see me. Oh, there, there we go. <laughs> right. <sighs> how do you feel to be on the first episode of Coag on the Couch? Oh, I'm buzzing. I'm so excited. <laughs> so excited. Well, basically today we're going to be running through uh, a few different activities. The first round is going to be our quick fire round. And I'm going to ask you a series of questions. And if I don't like the answers to any of them, or I think any of them are a wee bit boring, I'm going to... What, what do you even do with a harmonica? Do you toot it? Blow it? I'm going to go like this. And that means, that means you're going to have to gunk yourself with whatever you've got there that you've made for us. How does that sound? Okay. You got your gun? Yeah. Right then, here we go. What is one thing that you're fabulous at? Who picking? Who picking? <laughs> no, that was in picking? Yeah, you're gunking yourself for that. No. Oh, that was a rub off. <laughs> <laughs> okay, next one. Okay, okay. What's one thing that you're not so good at? What's one thing that you're rubbish at? Uh, oh, Making up dance. Too long a pause. <laughs> <laughs> I'm loving this gig. <laughs> okay, next okay. question. <laughs> Which film star do you have a secret crush on? Shrek. Shrek? Okay, I'll give you that. He is quite handsome. Right then, what makes you laugh the loudest? Banner with coaches. Oh god, that's stinky. Banner with coaches. I'm gonna give you that one as well because I'm a coach and I've got great banter. Um, what oh. motivates you the most? Oh, too Definitely. long a pause. Oh. <laughs> it's stinging my eyes. Get the whole shampoo. thing over your head. No, not yet, because we've got another two rounds. Oh. <laughs> It's like something over you. sick on it. It is serious, it's like sick. Eh, yuck. <laughs> <laughs> right then, okay, so that's the end of the first round. Well done, Nikki. You scored two points. <laughs> Superb. So for the next round, I'm wanting to see an interesting party trick that you've got. And if I don't like it, or it looks a bit rubbish, or if... I think that the viewers won't like it. I'm going to buzz you again. And then you're going to have to gunk yourself. Sorry. Okay. So whenever you're ready, take it away. Okay. I normally use a bottle of alcohol and a piece of string with your sellotape or a bracelet tight around your waist. And the idea is to hook the bottle. However, That's interesting. I thought I would change it up a little bit because I don't drink alcohol. So Lewis, you can have that later. Oh, thank you, thank you. Not that it's bribery. So I've got a tea bag and a mug. Two minutes, two minutes, two minutes. <laughs> and we're, we're in no way, shape or form advertising Sports Direct here. No, it was just the biggest mug I could find. Oh my goodness, what are you about to do? So you tie the tea bag and then you practice. Where is the tea bag? Oh, it's too short. <laughs> ah! Oh, Nikki, this is a disaster. I think you're going to get gunked. Oh, God, I thought, look, look, squat. Oh, that's, <laughs> now you're gone. <laughs> oh, what are you doing? <laughs> I had to get the tea bag in the cup. Right, you're going to have to gunk yourself now. 
Okay, I'm gonna have to take my glasses off. That's, just get that whole thing over your head. Do you want to count it in? Yeah, I'll count it in. Right, you ready? Five, four, three, two, one. Ding, ding, ding. <laughs> <laughs> you missed a spot. <laughs> Does it smell? Yes. <laughs> Does it smell nice or does it smell bad? No, it smells really bad because I use shampoo that I don't like and oh, just no. like stuff I don't like. Oh, uh, okay. Well, that brings an end to round two. Right then, Nikki, well <laughs> done for round two. <laughs> round two was out of two points and I'm going to give you one out of two points for purely for your creativity with that, um, that party trick. Um, I'm not quite sure it was a party trick. I don't really know what you were doing, but um, it was a. I'll give you well, one point. One point. One point. If I got one point. Up. Okay. Uh, uh, right. So round three, I'm wanting to hear a funny gymnastic story that you're going to tell me and tell our our viewers. We're currently sitting on three points. It's going to be okay. have to be a very good story, Nikki. I'm telling you now. Okay. So it's about flick, and you've got to do a little bit of visualization in it. So we used to train out on the Clement Hall, which should I close my eyes? Not, not yet, not yet. Okay. I'll give you the background, and then you can close okay. your eyes. So we used to work out on the Clement Hall, which was a really small, old hall. The roof leaked. We were constantly having to put buckets out every time the rain came on because it leaked right through. Um, so that's the background to the story. So if you close your eyes and visualize, I really visualize. I'm almost falling asleep here, Nikki. No, 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 it's good, it's good. Uh, so, no, 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 not yet, not yet, not yet. So imagine Flick, without her hip operation, hobbling into the gym, and she stands up on the platform to speak to me. And I could see that she was well, just- I think I like where this is going about and all of a sudden in like slow motion she fell back but as she fell back she stuck her foot in the bucket that was catching the leaky roof <laughs> she had 360 pivot and hit the deck her trainer got stuck in the bucket and the water went everywhere oh nikki i i can't i don't know how to tell you this but you can't be telling stories about her head coach like that so that's a straight straight away Dunk <laughs> yourself. Okay, okay. Oh, what is it this time? Flower. Oh, get it. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> right, okay, Nikki, well done for the last round. How did you find it? Fabulous. Fabulous. You're looking, you've got something on your head. Yeah, that looks absolutely disgusting. So the last round that we did was out of three points. I'm going to award you two of those points. You lost Yay! a point just purely because you got gunk, Jad put flour on yourself. Um, the other two points were for the, the, the good banter. It was, a, it was a good story. And you, you told it well as well. So I'll give you two points for it. So that means that today on Coag on the Couch, you have scored a respectable... Five out of ten. So give yourself a pat on the back for that. Well done. Yay! And as you can see, I've got the Coag on the Couch leaderboard sitting behind me. And you should be very proud of yourself. You have been put in first place. <laughs> so well done. My mum is also guilty for putting blue tack on the walls. <laughs> right, so for our viewers at home, we really want to hear what you think Nikki had in her gunk. So what was it? Was it bogeys? Was it vegetable soup? Was it carrots in it? We want to hear from you. Um, the other thing that we want to know is who you want to see on Coag on the Couch next week completing our challenges. So thanks for watching and we'll oh, see you next you time. Wait, wait, wait. Ready? What are you going to do? Oh! <laughs> Bye! Bye. <laughs>